looks like you can jump from there. It's raining a little bit, but that is the Zaki Cenote here in the downtown center of the city. There's people swimming there. Yeah, there's people in there. Not too many people though because it's overcast now. The sun isn't out anymore. Thanks for watching today's video. If you want to see more from us, make sure to subscribe to this YouTube channel. Make sure to follow our social media accounts where we'll be posting more content related to this YouTube channel. Mexico and Amor <laughs> finds the Burger King. <laughs> they have a really good deal. They have a blueberry with banana shake, like milkshake for 35 pesos, which is like a dollar fifty. Actually it's not a milkshake, it's just like a fruit shake, which is better. And then they have like a promotion for 29 Mexican pesos, a hamburger and a chicken burger. For, that's like a dollar fifty for two burgers. That's like the cheapest I've ever seen it. That's so, why I stopped. Amor wants to take advantage of that deal. <laughs> so even though we're in Mexico, we're in the Burger King, and they're playing country music. I guess it's still an American restaurant, huh? Stay true to your origins, <laughs> no matter where you where you go. So this is funny. Actually, I just noticed we're trying to get Wi-Fi, and the name of the Wi-Fi here in the Burger King in Mexico is La Casa de Whopper, means the House of Whopper. So let's see what you got. You got a coupon? Oh no, that's dangerous. Really happy. It didn't have chicken though, for you. No. Just cheeseburgers. So you're allowed to take your mask off to eat. <laughs> That's the only time. It's not bad for it though. $3 total. $1.50 for the blueberry banana smoothie. Cheaper and in the US, isn't Yeah, it's like 75 cents a burger. How is it? Does it taste like American or it's better or less? Has a lot of flavor. Wow. Really? Wow. It's spicy. No, the cheese is 
Oh, strong. Yeah, this is Mexico. <laughs> they like everything more powerful, I think, especially compared to the US. It's more calm. A lot of things, but more calm here. It's just like a couple, but really strong. So now that you've finished, what do you think? Really good. Really yeah. good. Everything really flavor. Yeah. Flavorful. Approves. <laughs> And then we're gonna get a little coupon book, mm -hmm. so he's really happy about that. Oh, <laughs> uh, by the way, that blueberry banana smoothie, I tried it. Wow, you so good. You tried it. <laughs> you drink it all. I drink like half of it, <laughs> but it was really, really good. I'm also really thirsty. It was a hot day today, so we walked a lot, so. And they wouldn't give us water for free. Water, they said, cost money for a cup of water. <laughs> so. <laughs> I just didn't drink half of his smoothie. It was really good. I don't know what they make it with, but I've never seen that in the U.S. But I also don't go to Burger King in the U.S., so I don't know if they have it. But yeah, we were walking and we saw it and we passed. And he likes Burger King, so here we are. Okay, so the Cenote restaurant. I got the wrong idea. I was told that the restaurant was inside of the Cenote. So I had this idea that like, Oh, you walk down into the cenote and then you can actually have dinner inside of the cenote. The restaurant is more on top of the cenote and next to it. So it's not necessarily in it. So if you sit down and eat, you can't actually feel like you're in it. You can't even really see it. You're just kind of next to it. It's there, but you can't see it from while you're eating dinner. So we decided to not eat there just because it wasn't what we were expecting. And we'd rather keep it moving and experience some other stuff, I wanna keep looking in some shops. They have really cute shops here, so we're gonna keep exploring a little bit while the sun is still up. It is raining, but it seems like it's gonna be like this for the rest of the afternoon. And it's just a little bit of rain, it's not too bad. So gonna check out some more shops and uh, explore the downtown a little more. Okay. So this is a traditional Mexican game that a lot of the kids play here. The name is Valero. Let's see if I can get this ball into this little hole here. Oh, hold on. I got it the I got it the third try, so I practiced and now that I've done it, I'm gonna show you guys how it works. Oh woo! Riva! <laughs> I am <laughs> Oh you hear the thunder? Yeah. So Amor, what did you buy? We bought some Mexican masks. Let's you wanna let's show the people. So we actually bought there was three of them. We bought the other too. Okay. And then I bought also, I love the lucky hands. So I got myself one of these. It was only $1, so 25 pesos. And the mask was 45 pesos, it's like $2. Gracias, ciao. Bye. Bye. <laughs> she had to rush. Let's go. Vamonos. Oh, look at this little storm. But it's okay, we keep going. This is a fun little city to do some shopping. They got a lot of nice little shops. A chocolate shop. She directs the traffic even in the rain. That's pretty hardcore. Let's walk past these little stands so it looks like they have little stands throughout the park right now it's raining so it looks like some of them are closed but normally look they have shopping and oh it's open it's just from the other side it's for the rain but they have drinks and little snacks and gum and all kinds of little things you can take for your beautiful day in the park and drinks and juices I secretly really want one of these Viva Mexico sombreros. Let's see.
Thanks for watching this video. Here, I leave you with one more video to watch. Just click the photo on the left hand side. Enjoy!